All right, folks, the deck is Big Beast Hunter. The goal of the deck is to play Mystery Egg so that we can get the mini copy, then use a combination of Machnathal, Lion, and Princess Hurahan with a Tundra Rhino on board so that we can summon a bunch of stuff from our deck and bash our opponent in the face with it. If you're watching this on YouTube, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. You can catch me live at twitch.tv slash Raffle. Watch this! Feel the power. Ow. I will never serve. All right, Trinket Tracker, good card. Stitched Tracker, good card for what we're trying to do here. That could be good if we run into one of the like, failure situations. I'm a little bit concerned about like Druid having the armor gain. Okay, let's do this. Get a preemptive cost reduction on our um, egg. Oh, I should have avoided taking a beast in case we need to spinly, right? Ah. Okay. Egg. Unlucky. I'm gonna just trade straight up here. Got anything good? Um, simply because board space can be an issue at times. Tracking? No. Okay. Uh, I might have to spend my next turn if I don't hit. Stay alert, my children. I guess I could play this and then spin Lee. That might be a wise thing to do. Just so that I'm not putting it back into my deck. Let's test this first. Egg? Alright, next turn we start with the spin Lee. No taunts. Just ramp. Alright. Just hit the egg. No need to spinly now. And we've got these to trigger it, so we've got like multiple chances at this. actually fine. That's not, though. Okay, I need to find Lethal here. So let's go here. You're dead. Okay, that worked out. Thank you. Wait, why is new Edwin so handsome? I will never serve. Okay, probably Pirate Rogue if I had to guess. So let's keep for Pirate Rogue. We do like need stuff on board in order to get um, Lion value. Or is the Hooran can just kind of uh, do her thing. There be no treasure six feet under. The living grab all kinds of things. Okay, this and the bola shot is kind of nice. But I can't imagine Pirate Rogue is the best chip in the world for me. There be
in all Trasher, six feet under. Package type for treasure transport. That doesn't seem like the best possible order. But let's clean this up before things get real weird. Fortunately, that leaves me without a greedy partner. Or at least an opportunity to copy a greedy partner. Get a coin. Same thing. Oh, right. I forgot about the whole, like, they drew patches thing. Start egging them on a little bit. Job's done. Let's preemptively grab that trade. Now it does look like we're in a good spot, but the deck runs a pretty absurd amount of draw these days, so it doesn't necessarily mean much. Okay. That was a really good draw, not just because it could have given me like the opportunity to play double greedy partner, but also just cleaned up the board nicely. Like that Grievous Bite buff is uh, kind of silly. Okay, there's the card draw I was worried about. I think I just have to kill that with the uh, the lion because they just keep tempoing stuff. If I let them, yeah, like there's just it's unacceptable to leave that on the board. That is, in fact, how we lose from here. Trade our coin for a coin. What is this card? It's not getting played. Oh, it could be the... No, I don't think it's the grow version. It could be. Okay, let's coin the Feign Death. See what we hit here. Nice. 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 We are a little bit short on damage. But that was a pretty good setup. Your turn. Oh, it was Zilliax this whole time. There was just not nearly enough minions on board. It's not meant to be. I will crush your defiance as I crushed you. Let's keep the tracking and look for like trinket tracker as well. Just want the card draw so that I can get to the not the worst one to hit, but it's kind of clunky still. I just want to get to the egg and uh, like the death rattle trigger effects. Okay. Plagues could be a little bit disruptive, mostly just exactly frost plague. The moment is upon us. More coins, we have this as an activator. One dose solves any problem. Nerfed card bowl. Okay, there's our egg. I raise you fold. My pain doesn't compare to your plague. <laughs> I actually have the capacity to just get the egg down next turn. I don't know how good it is. But we can try it out, right? I don't think I want to go in on the Devouring Swarm just yet. See if they kill it off. You have earned an eternity of torment. I kind of do need more mana for the, uh... Okay. 
uh, to get the Tundra Rhino down. So we should be able to go in next turn, right? We play the one mana egg, coin, Tundra Rhino, and then hopefully look to chain the uh, Hoover Hands. So good attack for me. This is again where the uh, Frost Plague could be a bit of a problem. Impossible. No, it's extremely possible. It literally just happened. The Citadel stands strong. Okay. So let's do this first. Oh my god. Currently one damage off legal. But we get to break the egg again. Oh my You're gonna deny me that? Come on! Well, I fight in the name of honor. I will never serve. Uh let's keep the trackers, both of them. Paladin is often even, I guess. Not this time, though. I need to stop drawing you. Let's do this, but I'm not going to play it. What if we just coin this and go for, like, a board-based tempo play instead of a, like... All out combo to face. What? You think you can take me? Hmm. Yeah, this might be a problem. I think it's unlikely that they're going to kill this, is also a problem, so I need to find like a play dead off of this. That's horrendous, my god. The moment is upon us. Okay, at least we do get to clean up the board here. We also just run into the risk of getting holy wrathed. Job done. Could also use this to find a spin lead, then break these and start chaining the two of these, maybe. So it's not entirely lost yet, it's just not necessarily the best spot in the world. Also kind of realizing the opponent uh, doing something here. My blade vengeance. Okay. Wait, is he broken? What's going on here? Did that really do anything, though, I guess is the question. Let's go here, see if we can get the spin lane. I missed. My board is not easily cleared, so I've got that at least.
Jeez. Um, it's ten twenty. I'm still short, even if I play the uh, Tundra Rhino. the healing. I was, like, if I got the Finley, there's a world where we could get there. Uh, unfortunately, now, I just died to um, Order in the Court plus Holy Wrath here. You fight yeah. with nobility. That was uh, extraordinarily unlucky for me. You fight with nobility. I swore an oath to defeat you. I cannot break. Sincerely. <laughs> Wild has some of the worst <laughs> uh, portions of the player base. That was uh, a painfully, painfully unlucky game. This is an okay hand. This helps me find the egg. This helps me get it early. And this at least activates the uh, greedy partner, even if not being a great pickup itself. Dragon's not bad. This could be a cheap activator for our egg as well. It's not questline. Not really sure what Warlock is up to with uh, Renethal in any context. Your wish is my that explains chest. it. And it makes the most sense. But I am happy to see it come down earlier before, like, silence... God. Before silence effects are a thing. The moment is upon us. Okay, let's do this. Oh. That increases the chances of a who round. Which we will need several of in addition to the Tundra Rhino to uh, get us there. Egg? The moment is upon us. So we can at least get a start next turn. I see a good reason to break that right now. Could do it next turn and like make an appropriate decision based on what they do, or it could just heal us for five if they attack into it. damage off legal. That time we did get uh, pretty lucky. The We got really unlucky at the start with the uh, lions, but then the uh, the Hoover hands came in clutch and redressed us towards the main. Well done. Such skill. Then why 
someone like you. Now this is an opponent. Giving us the opportunity to get lethal despite them getting pretty unlucky and us getting lucky. It's like the exact opposite of the previous opponent. Uh, probably need the explosive trap in case of even shaman. Okay, not even shaman, so I have a dead card, but that's okay. This is a much better matchup, at least, so I don't have to stress about it being even shaman, if nothing else. Our gift of the arcane enlightens us. Egg. The moment is upon us. Can coin that out next turn. Nature waits for no one but me. It's possible there's a devolve off of that because it is a nature spell, but um, we still have the mini egg. I will show you. Here. Here. Stunning. Here. You die. Now. You die. That was a pretty clean setup. I think the cleanest that we've had. Just getting those uh, trackers in hand was kind of repulsive. I see the machinations of your dark heart. I will never serve. Oh, here's the quest line, Warlock. Only a matter of time, I suppose. There's our egg, though. So I can get that down next turn. Which is pretty gross. I don't actually want to kill that. Leaving that stuff on board is to my benefit a lot of time. Because we can crash into it with the lion. As kind of a redo for the, uh... What's in an ETC for this deck? Okay. It should eventually get us there. It's actually a pretty good draw. <laughs> like, hitting both of the lions... If you're going to hit any minions, you want it to be the lions for sure. No, don't frack me. Okay, so now I just need to hit another copy of the rhino. And one of these. And we get there. Easy game. Turn five lethal again. Okay.
Thank you.